Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Sunday. Um, Chad and I have a lot we need to get done today. Chad woke up this morning and just really wanted a breakfast sandwich, what we didn't want to cook. So he just ran up to this local sandwich shop that's actually owned by FGCU graduates and he picked us up some breakfast sandwiches and I got the craziest breakfast sandwich when it gets here. I just can't wait to show you guys. It is something else. Okay, we are definitely not counting calories here. <laughs> My breakfast sandwich is made on a glazed donut. It has an egg, cheese, and bacon on a freaking glazed donut. How amazing does this look? I'm gonna do a taste test because I don't know if I will ever try this sandwich again. I freaking knew it. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be so good. This is life changing. Just finished eating that breakfast and I didn't even finish half of it. It was so filling, but so good. I don't even care about the calories. That's how good it was. So I just wrote my to-do list for the day and I have a lot to get done today. I have two videos I'm going to film. I have a Q&A that I'm going to film finally. I asked you guys on Instagram what kind of questions that you had for me about opening up my own online store and I'm gonna answer all your questions because that's been like one of the most frequently requested videos. And I'm also gonna film a very exciting what's in my purse slash what's in my bag video because I got a new bag and you guys, I am so excited about this. I'm actually gonna show it to you guys in a second, but I got like my dream purse, so I just have to do a what's in my bag video. I have some somebody orders that I have to package up that are gonna go out tomorrow. I have to do tagging for a bunch of items that are dropping on Friday, which by the way, if you don't know, the next drop is this coming Friday, July 10th at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, um, I have to put weights in for everything because that's how I've been able to lower my shipping costs is by inputting all of the weights. So everything that ships is based on location and weight now. So it's just a lot smarter for me and for you guys, it's cheaper. I have to edit my vlog from like two days ago because that's probably gonna go up today or tomorrow. I'm gonna go to Victoria's Secret today. <laughs> And I'm gonna get new bras. Even though I have complained about Victoria's Secret bras so many times, they're like not my favorite. They're not the most comfortable. Um, they're honestly the bras that I just have the most success with. I have tried the Airy bras. Um, I've tried two different types from them, just like trying to go for more comfort. And I find that it makes my boobs look frumpy. <laughs> like we can't have that. So I don't know. I haven't tried a lot of the brands that you guys recommended that are online just because I have to order them online and then wait for them to come in. And I just, I want to be able to like actually try on my bra. I did get one from the Auden brand that's from Target that I actually do really like. Um, it's not bad at all, but I just, I need some new bras. So I'm just going to go to Victoria's Secret and I have to pack for a trip that I am leaving for tomorrow. It's a little staycation. So I have this ginormous bag that's full of scrunchies because you guys know I like to give away little freebies when you guys spend like a certain amount on my website, just as like a little thank you gift. So I'm just going to start taking three of the little scrunchies and putting my little sun bunny tags on them and then putting them in this little container here so that they are ready to go out with your orders. So I'm about to start putting the weights in for all of the items and basically here's my scale. I just put the shipping package that I expect that item to go in. Usually it's this size poly mailer or one of these bubble mailers if it's something smaller. Um, so this is about 0.3 ounces and then I go ahead and put whatever the item is on top. So this is the Sun Bunny t-shirt that's dropping on Friday so I'll just put that on top and then I get my average weight and then I add like maybe 0.2 or 0.3 ounces to it just to account for like tissue paper, the stickers and the invoice, things like that that I'll throw in with it and then I chart it online that way when you guys choose this shirt it knows how much to charge you for shipping. Here's a little sneak peek of the Gretchen cow neck cami that's dropping on Friday. It's so cute. I'm going to insert a picture I took with some gold jewelry of this shirt on. It's so pretty the way that it sits around the neckline and it has like a mocha tan tie-dye. <laughs> The quality t-shirts are coming back this Friday, by the way, definitely the most popular item. 100% of the proceeds are being donated for the Black Lives Matter movement, but I know these are gonna go so fast, so make sure you guys get them quick. This time I ordered six packages of these shirts, so I have a lot of unpackaging and tagging to do, so I'm gonna get all of that done, and then maybe we'll take a little break. I'm heading to Victoria's Secret now so I can go get some bras, and I'm gonna stop and get my afternoon 
coffee. Got to the shopping center where Victoria's Secret is, so I'm just gonna run in there really quick and grab two new bras. And then we're gonna pop into Starbucks and grab my afternoon coffee and then go home and start cleaning the house. Literally have to clean everything. Pat and I are leaving tomorrow. We're going on a little staycation and I'm really excited about it. I didn't say anything about it because I actually didn't think it was gonna happen. We planned this at like the beginning of the year and then everything with COVID happened and I just was like, yeah, it's not gonna happen. But then we found out we can't get our deposit back and I guess they're taking a lot of precautions. We're not gonna be around a bunch of other people. We're staying on a little villa that's right out by the beach. We're gonna do all of our grocery shopping and bring our stuff with us and cook while we're there. So I feel like the risk of going is pretty minimal. They're requiring everybody to wear face masks. Like even if you just go out to a restaurant while you're in the lobby, anytime you're around anyone, you pretty much have to have a face mask on. So I'm honestly really looking forward to just getting out of here and having a break from everything. So that's why today has to be super productive because we're coming back either Thursday night or Friday morning and the next launch for somebody is Friday at 10 a.m. So we have to make sure everything's ready for that. Well, I am back and I guess it wasn't meant to be. Literally, as I was walking up, the woman was posting a sign on the door that says we're temporarily closed. I'm like, what? Literally, what are the freaking odds that they would be closing as I'm walking up like literally taping a sign on the door. I don't even, uh, the Victoria's Secret bras were not meant to be, but we are gonna go get a coffee. It never recognizes my face with these sunglasses on. I don't know why. It will with other sunglasses, but not with these ones. Back home now, I got my fuel. I'm actually gonna edit a vlog that's going up tomorrow and then we're gonna finish up some stuff with somebody and then we're gonna start cleaning. I'm about to show you guys something very exciting. I finally got my dream purse, guys. I have wanted this bag for so long. It's the Louis Vuitton Palm Springs mini backpack and I've had my eye on it forever, but it was definitely an investment, so I decided to treat myself after launching Sun Bunny. The first two drops were extremely successful, so I thought this would be my little gift to myself. Guys, it is literally beautiful. I am so obsessed with it, and I did buy this bag off of Poshmark. They're actually completely sold out on the Louis Vuitton website right now, and I also didn't mind the fact that it was gently used. It has literally no signs of use. I mean, it looks brand new. It came in the original box with the paperwork, and it was authenticated by Poshmark. I put this little poof charm on it and I am just so excited guys. I already posted a picture on Instagram and so many of you guys want me to do a what's in my bag video. So I was gonna do it in this vlog but I think I'm just gonna make it its own dedicated video. Stay tuned for that.
later, Chad and I cleaned every single inch of our entire house. So it feels really good. Our house is nice and clean. And now we're about to make breakfast for dinner. Chad's got the pancakes going. We're just doing pancakes and eggs because that's all we have. But we didn't feel like ordering out again because we ate out earlier. So we thought we would just do breakfast for dinner. I'm about to hop in the shower and shave every inch of me and then exfoliate. And I wanted to show you guys, this is basically like the products that I use whenever I self tan. So this is the face wash I use. It has little teeny tiny beads in it so you can exfoliate your face gently. And then this is the exfoliator that I use on my body. I love this stuff. This is my second time purchasing it. And it's actually almost gone. So I'm gonna have to get another one. So I just finished self tanning and I had Chad do my back for me and I use this new self tanner called Dripping Gold in the Ultra Dark. I just really wanted to try something new and I ran out of my loving tan so I decided to give this one a try. I'll let you guys know how it turns out whenever I rinse it off in the morning. So it's the next morning and I woke up tan which is like the best feeling in the world. I'm very impressed with the self tanner. I really like the color it gave me. It seems to be a little bit more of a natural bronze color than the loving tan which I never thought I would say that because I've been using loving tan for a long time and I love that one but I really like this one. I'll show you guys the color of my legs. They're so dark and bronzy. They look really good. I'm happy with it. I'm in the midst of packing everything for this trip and I hate packing because I always get so stressed out that I'm going to forget something, but I just packed a bunch of denim, like shorts, jeans, all of that over here. And then in this one, I have shirts and stuff to pair with the denim and like a couple of little sundresses. My bag, actually this bag, guys, little sneak peek. It's coming Friday to Sun Bunny. It's the cutest little net like beach bag. Quality's amazing. It's really beautiful and I can't wait to use it on the beach. This one's full of bikinis. I love these packing cubes. I got them off Amazon. They really help just like keep your stuff all separated. In here I have comfortable clothes just like pajamas and sweatpants. A hoodie in case I get cold. It's just a polka dot romper from my store. I might wear if we end up like having a nice dinner or something. And I also brought this in case I want to take some cute photos on the beach. This canvas backpack has my laptop, iPad, and then this little thing full of chargers and stuff in case I need my computer for anything which I'm sure that I will and then in here I have underwear bras and like sandals I just know I'm forgetting something I feel like I kind of want to end this vlog here and just start a new one because we're gonna be leaving in a few hours we actually have to go take the dogs to the vet that's where we board them while we're gone they freaking love it it's like a little doggy resort they get to stay in the same little spot we bring their blanket and their toys with them so yeah we have to go take them and then we're heading there check-ins at three o'clock we're probably not gonna get there until like four or five. I haven't really decided if I want to do a vlog while I'm there or not or if I just want to like live in the moment and not worry about pulling my camera out and just like post stuff on social media about it but I don't know but I am going to end this one here because I feel like this is long enough so if I do decide to vlog it then I'll just be vlogging like from the start of the trip. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.